Going on a cruise is all about fun and relaxation, but packing your common sense is just as important as bringing your flip-flops, if you want to stay safe. When you board a cruise ship, even here in Fort Lauderdale, you're stepping foot on foreign soil and heading for the open sea where U.S. laws may not apply. While I don't think that um, people should be afraid of cruising, um, people should really be informed about what can happen on board cruising and how to best protect themselves. Crime on cruise ships is rare considering 10 million North Americans sailed last year. And experts say passengers could avoid trouble by following these tips. Leave your valuables at home. Don't overdo it on the alcohol. No one should roam the ship alone, especially kids. When in port, don't wander off on your own. And keep important phone numbers with you. Uh, the bottom line is bad people take cruises also. Criminals take cruises, so be aware of your surroundings. The Sun Sentinel went through 363 incidents cruise lines reported to the FBI between December 2007 and October 2008. The study shows the unique circumstances of how being at sea can complicate crime investigations and prosecutions. That's why the FBI recommends passengers conduct themselves as they would on land. The cruise line, they, they can only do so much. The individual is also responsible for their own actions. You know, we never at one time felt that we were not safe. Um, again, there was always somebody around. Reporting in Fort Lauderdale for The Morning Show, I'm Jacqueline Giovis.